'Twas the night before Christmas, or Christmith, whichever, by Daniel Lazarus. 'Twas the night before Christmas, when all through the house, not an atheist was stirring, not even their spouse. The beer cans were stacked by the chimney with care, in hopes that Uncle Larry would soon be there. The children were nestled all snug in their beds, while visions of quantum theories danced in their heads. And Mama in her lingerie, and I in the nude, had just jumped in the bed. Oh God, you're the dude! When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from the bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters, threw open the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave the luster of the midday to objects below. When what to my wandering I should appear? But a drunk fat man peeing on my lawn and sipping a beer. With a great big old belly so drunk and hairy, I knew in a moment it must be Uncle Larry. More staggering and stumbling he came, and he whistle, whistled and shouted and called us by name. Now Daniel, now Teresa, now Brady and Dixon, on Marsha, on Chris, on, on Harry and Nixon, to the top of the porch, to the top of the wall, I'm gonna puke, so dash away all! <laughs> and then in a twinkle, I heard on the porch the collapse of Uncle Larry as he tripped on a toy Porsche. As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the hall Uncle Larry came with a bound. He was dressed in all rags from his head to his feet, and his clothes were all tarnished with piss and shit. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a burglar just opening his sack. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples, how merry. His cheeks were pocked acne, his nose was all hairy. His herpes-infected mouth was drawn up like a bow. And the beard of his chin was as brown as, well, you know, the stump of the bowl he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. He had smoked two pounds and rubbed at his belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of pickles. Yep, pickles. He was a fat-ass troll, a fucked-up old elf, and I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave me the willies and everything to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the stockings with shit what a jerk and laying his finger aside of his nose and giving a nod blew a snot rocket on my clothes. He ran out the front door to his team gave a whistle and away they all ran down the street like a missile. But I heard him exclaim ere he collapsed out of sight, happy Christmas to all and to all a good blah!